me laugh time and again even when I've had a rough day and I'm determined that nothing could even make me smile. When I think about whatever is going wrong is for sure a catastrophe and nothing can make it okay again. You commonly point out how everything is going to be alright. I love how when I'm wrong you don't just blindly agree with me. You show me how I can be right again. I love the way you make me feel beautiful even when I know I look like a deceitful mess. Just being with you makes me happy and I wish I could stretch out the moments we're together to make them last forever. I'll admit, years ago, I never thought I would be here in front of these people with anyone. In fact, early on, I thought girls were icky and had cooties, but I grew out of it. As I got older, I never really thought I would really want to share my life with anyone. <laughs> We've been together, excuse me. <clears throat> We've been together so long, I don't want to imagine it without you. I would think that my most favorite thing about you is how you seem to have strength where I have my biggest you're calm and rational when I'm worked up and thoughtless. You remember what needs to be done when I'm scattered and forgetful. You're patient when I would rush. You're sensible and calming when, I'm in a when I am irrational, and for that you have my unkind gratitude. On the other hand, what I have to say is my absolute favorite thing about you, yes, they're all absolute favorites, is how you make me feel needed. You need and appreciate when I cook for you. What little you seem to forget seems to occur on the rare occasions when I remember it. I remember the names of movies and songs and shows when you remember the basic idea but can't remember what it's called. When work or life gets too stressful, I can make you laugh. <laughs> and every time you laugh, I fall in love all over again. Sorry. <clears throat> I would not be doing this justice, however, if I did not point out my most favorite thing about you, and that's how perfect you are for me. We both love the same geeky shows, music, games, and films, and always on the lookout for things the other might like. We think of the other before ourselves, and sometimes we get upset at the other for not thinking of themselves when they think they ought. And we both love to talk and to share the silence. And for that, thank you. May I have the rings, please? The ring? is an ancient symbol, so perfect and so simple. It has no beginning, it has no end. It is round like the sun, like the moon, like the eye, like arms that embrace. It is a circle, for love that is given comes back around again. Your rings are precious because you wear them with love. They symbolize your commitment in marriage. They remind you of who you are, where you've been, and where you're going. As you wear them through time, they will reflect not only who you are as individuals, but also who you are as a couple. Lorena, place the ring on Chris's finger and repeat after me. Is 
Okay. I offer my vow to you in the form of this ring. I offer my vow to you in the form of this ring. So that my word and my love. So that my word and my love will always be with you. Will always be with you. Close to your heart. Close to your heart. It will be a reminder. It will be a reminder. That I will love, honor, and cherish you. That I will love, honor, and cherish you. In all times. In all times. In all places. In all places. And in all ways forever. And in all ways forever. Now I ask you, Lorena, do you take Christopher to be your lawfully wedded husband to love, to honor, and to cherish? I do. All right, Christopher, take the ring and place it on Lorena. And repeat after me. I offer my vow to you in the form of this ring. I offer my vow to you in the form of this ring. So that my word and my love so, and to cherish. I do. <coughs> today, Lena, Lorena and Caress have. Today, Lorena and Caress have chosen to symbolize their love to each other in a special sand ceremony. So, as you'll notice, this empty glass. Glass itself is made from sand. The grains of sand having come to this timeless process reminds us all of our eternal love and mortality. Please, Lorena and Chris, each of you take your separate glass and, alternating the pouring of sand into this joining vessel, repeat after me. You are my love for eternity. You are my love for eternity. I blend with you. I blend with you. My heart is like these grains of sand merging with yours. My heart is like these grains of sand merging with yours. I am yours, you are mine. I am yours, you are mine. We are together forever like the sand and like the wind. We are together forever like the sand and like the wind. This is the final one. We are one. We are one. To complete today's ceremony, Lorena and Chris have chosen to release butterflies that are native to Central Texas. As we watch the butterflies stretch their wings and begin this chapter of their life journey, here in this lovely garden, at the conclusion of this beautiful ceremony, we know that Lorena and Chris are doing the same. They are beginning the next chapter of their life's journey together. blessing. May the wings of the butterfly kiss the sunlight and find your shoulder to light upon to bring you luck, happiness, and riches today, tomorrow, and beyond. Lorena and Chris, I pronounce you Mary. You may kiss each other. Hey.